what... But uh, we do have to talk about how uh, APK has been impressing us. Actually, level 2 is going to be hit down here on the bottom side. Secret in a lot of trouble, actually. I think he's got to flash. And it's work. Take Metro unless necessary. And oh, other boy. than that, everything's pretty normal. Yeah. Sort of well, like ganking Taco. <laughs> this is going to be pretty normal, I suppose. He doesn't have his flash. And it should be enough damage. The Cataclysm finally comes out. It's going to trap Flawless in here, but he's going for the kill. As is he even going to get it? I don't think he will, as Kana is going to put the missile straight into his face. As so maybe Darvin's just going to run down to bottom and summon it there. As we just take a look at the replay, Equalizer comes out, and Kana able to just do so much damage as well. As it was a nice attempt by Flawless to try to trade one for one, then maybe look for a way out. Yeah, but... the, the... He says, uh, let's try to do this. Okay. 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 Yeah, which well, is not something I have to I cut you off there. Before. There's no dash, no flash. They're going in for this one. He is going to die. Really clean, low action games. Have a good time. You see the TP come in, and even though the group doesn't land, they still fall for the game. And it all pans out. Yeah. Azir doesn't have a way out. So Darvin able to get in there. The roam from effort able to pay off his uh, GLP really nicely and just putting that on that aggression oh no who's stuck in here with who flawless runs straight into the callista really unfortunate timing for them he's gonna flash and you can see that effort just waits for it really making it look effortless to be honest another kill he's gonna go their way and uh how about another one here cover he's trying to run away but still no flash that's going for it oh no it's not kana <laughs> or was it <laughs> nice try there actually on the predict with the yeah Three minutes now until the Mountain Dragon comes up as APK. You can see Ixu trying to trade really hard on Takana, but there's no way to follow this up when you see that the other T1 members are still coming. And that's why he tried to turn around, but it ended up just being all too late as Ixu eventually got dogged down as well by the Callista. And right here, really good route by Faker. GLP 800 active coming out as well. And Azir, without a flash, we assume that T1 should be at about two and a half items across the board, where you can see the APK, they're struggling to get their second item. They found Flawless here in the jungle. He's trying to get away. We got Kana up against Ixu on the side. He's gonna miss the chains. And now Flawless in a bit of trouble as he's desperately trying to hit that plant. He is gonna flash away. Missile's gonna miss and Ixu's all alone. Where's the rest of APK? Uh, uh, cover's just pushing, and they say, yeah, you got caught, we can't help you out. And he wasn't respecting the ability for that gangster to come out, so they're really offering nothing to APK in this game because of the way Kana is playing weak side. And now they're just going to go for the Baron here as Baker is on guard duty. He's desperately trying to survive here. He is going to have to flash right at the end as a steal. Can it come in? Waiting for that smite, waiting for it to get low enough, and it will go the way of T1 at the end. LM is going to have to flash over this wall as it doesn't look like anyone on the side of ABK <laughs> will be able to catch up. Faker really likes that Rumble skin as he transforms back into Rumble. WTF2 Rumbles. As 
You can see Ixu trying to mess with Tarek. And I think that they're Teddy's. trying to gauge if Ixu's by himself. <laughs> um, Tower did go down. And that's but exactly that. why I'm not impressed. Okay. I feel like T1 has a lot to improve Fair. on. Fair. This game as they let that turret die. As here inside of this replay, Flawless, I mean, he just gets completely collapsed on by all of the members of T1. Equalizer does end up whipping. Flash used by Kana eventually gets him with the harpoons. And Teddy is just Vlad the Impaler this game as he is rending everybody. As this Callista gonna have Bloodthirst just soon, 50 seconds to kill the next Mountain <laughs> Dragon as I really appreciate production this time having the AP oh, overlay. They get this we're getting to witness T1 playing Flash, and I really hope the round two opponent is a little bit strong. This is, this is just one-sided. I mean, there's not really much else to say about it. It's just they are rolling face over them. The APK are just, like, hanging out in their jungle. They think it's their jungle. It's not. You can't stand there. Oh, here comes Triple Rumble. <laughs> oh, man, he funneled them up against the wall, and they're all going to get burned. I think this game is just going to end. That's going to be the end of that guy's life. And T1 are going to push to finish. So this was an almost perfect game, Valdez. I, I, even though Azir is coming up in 10 seconds, he doesn't have his ultimate available. I do think this is the end. Baker sending out his clone to try to tank any sort of aggro. Azir coming up in two seconds. Eight Aatrox spawn from the fountain. They might not even try. Who's going to focus down Nexus and what is one of the fastest games we've had in LCK in a very long time.